When you run online ads on any platform, it's always a good idea to check the works of other advertisers in your industry to get ideas for your own ads. The good news is, most major advertising platforms have an ad transparency library where you can research ads and creatives by type, date, and country. In this video, I'm going to review the ad library of some of the well-known advertising platforms. Let's start with ads repository for X or Twitter. X.com provides a limited resource for searching previous advertisements on its network. You can search ads by an advertiser's Twitter handle, choose the country, and select a time range. Then it will create a CSV report for you that you can download. Since the report is a CSV spreadsheet, you cannot view the creatives used in the ads, so not really so helpful for idea generation. You need to know the name of the advertisers that you want to see the ads for. The number of countries that you can choose for your report is very limited. For example, it doesn't include the United States or Canada. So to be honest, I wasn't even able to find any ads when I searched for a few global brands because I don't know which brands are using X to advertise in those available European countries. Also, the report takes a few minutes to export, which is very slow compared to today's standards. So all in all, I can say this ads repository by x.com is quite useless in terms of doing research. Ads repository for Pinterest. The countries that you can search the advertisements on Pinterest ads repository are similar to x.com. So the United States and Canada are missing from the list. By now, I can assume that there is some obligation in the European Union for advertising platforms to disclose the ads on their networks to the public. So that's probably why they are only allowed to search for ads in European countries. Here, you can search for ads by country, gender, and age group. The advertiser name field has a drop down that you can find all available advertisers, which is very helpful. And the best of all, you can see all available creatives without even having to search for that. Each creative has a details button, which when you click on, it shows you the details targeting that the respective advertiser used for that ad, when the ad was live, what age and interest groups were used in targeting, and which countries were targeted. So overall, this can be a pretty helpful tool for competitor research if you want to run ads on Pinterest. Ads library by Reddit. Reddit provides a library of top ads which seems to be designed as a sales tactic to educate more advertisers. Here, you can search for ads by typing a keyword in the text, which is very helpful. For example, if you want to search crypto related ads, this makes the job so easy for you. While you cannot search ads by location, there are other unique filters that can be valuable to you, including industry, advertiser's budget, ad format, placement, and objective. When you hover your mouse over the creative, a view details button appears that somehow analyzes why this particular ad is considered a top ad on Reddit. It provides some explanations about the headline, CTA, and messaging which you can get inspiration from to design your ads. Great job, Reddit! LinkedIn Ad Library LinkedIn allows you to search for ads by either typing a company name or by a keyword. You can search for ads in all countries, including the United States and Canada. This is a very helpful tool to perform competitor research and to get ideas to design your ad. For example, 
If I am looking for ads related to promoting Google ad services in the United States, I can easily search for it and get lots of ideas. By clicking on view details, you can see the full ad copy and creative for any ad. So LinkedIn ad library can be a helpful tool for advertisers that want to advertise on this social network. Ads library by TikTok. Similar to some other platforms, TikTok only allows you to search for ads in European countries. You can select an ad target location and a specific advertiser name or keyword to look for inspirations. Let's say I want to look for ads related to fashion on TikTok. A simple search will show me many creatives in that industry which can help me to get inspirations. Clicking on the ad will take you to the details page where you can see more details including the targeted country and additional parameters such as gender, age, and audience. It also shows the estimated unique reach for the ad. Ads Gallery by Snapchat In Snap Ads Gallery, you can search for ads and commercial content in European Union countries in the past 12 months. To search for ads, you need to know the exact spelling of the advertiser. I admit that I don't have much knowledge of Snapchat social media, so I search for Nike brand by chance and luckily it returned me results. Similar to other platforms that we've reviewed so far, there is a see details button that will show you the details for each ad, including the targeted country, demographics, start and end date, and total impressions for the ad. Apart from ads, there is also a tab for commercial content that you can view. From my understanding, Commercial content is any content that is not a traditional advertising and is a promoted content by any brand or individual. Facebook Ad Library Facebook Ad Library is helpful for advertisers on Meta to search for ads on Facebook and Instagram. You can select any country in the list select the category of the ads which typically is all ads and search for ads either by keyword or advertiser name. For example, here I search for ads related to the keyword for dentist in the United States. By clicking on the details on each ad, I can see the full creative and headline and description and even click on the CTA button to see the landing page. So if you are doing competitor research or looking for some inspirations for your advertisement ideas, Meta Ads Library can be a helpful tool in your research. Google's Ad Transparency Center is a platform to show ads by advertisers on Google Ads. You can see ads in a specific country on any of Google's platforms, including Google Search, YouTube, Google Shopping, Google Map, and Google Play by typing an advertiser's name or website. Here, I'm going to search for Airbnb website in the United States location to see their ads on Google. In the results, you can choose image, text, and video formats to see different types of ads. By clicking on video ads, I can watch the full video creative used in the advertisement. Google's Ad Transparency Center is a very helpful tool for performing competitor research to see how your competitors write their ad copy, design their image ads, and create their video ads. Ads Library by Microsoft On Microsoft Ads Library, you can find ads shown on Bing search engine 
by searching ad content or advertiser name. I'm searching for ads by Microsoft company. The countries are limited to European countries only, so you cannot see ads in the United States. Microsoft Ads Library might not have so many use cases for you, as most advertisers typically use the same ad copy and creative that they use on Google Ads for Microsoft Advertising too. When running advertisements, having access to resources to do research and get inspiration is always helpful. The ad libraries provided by major advertising platforms can be a valuable tool for you to perform competitor research, get creative ideas, and run successful campaigns. I hope you found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos related to online advertising. Thank you.